Hi, in this screencast we're going to talk about setting text alignment using CSS. This rule allows you to set the horizontal alignment of your uh, content. And I set a content uh, because even though its main, uh, its main purpose is to set alignment for text, it applies to uh, everything else in the container you assign this rule to. Okay, but let me just show you uh, what this rule looks like. In my CSS folder, I have an index.html. Let me open it with top style. Okay, I have a HTML document with empty style sheet. Okay, and also in the body, I have a table with three rows. Okay, one, two, three, and then three columns. And this is the header row, so uh, I use th. Okay, it's going to bold this text and also center align it. Okay, so uh, you would know that this is the header. So first column I use username, second column I use email, third column I use description. Okay, and the second row, uh, second row, row uh, has a username one in the first cell, first column to match the username column. Okay. The second column has the email to match the email column. Okay. Uh, the third column is the description of this user. Um, I just have a very brief description that says a very funny person. So the second row is for one user. The third row is for another user which has username, email, and also a description. Okay. And then I ended the table. Uh, the table settings are like this. I have uh, cell padding 0, cell spacing 0, border of 2, so you can see um, how the table looks like. And then I gave it a width of 500. Okay. And let's just preview this in our browser. Let's minimize top style. Double click on the index.html. And so you'll see this in your browser. Uh, I want you to pay attention to how uh, the texts are aligned. Okay, for now you see that the table is this wide, and it's distributed evenly. Okay, and uh, the member, uh, the second and third row, the texts are all aligned left. Okay, and so uh, this is when we start setting the alignment style. Let's set up a, a few classes. Let's first set up a left class, okay? That does text align, which is right here. And our choices are left, right, center, and justify. Let's set the left one, okay? Escape it. And let's set a right one, okay? Okay, let's set a center class. Oops. Okay. Okay. And let's set, oops. Set a justify class. Oops. Okay. So this looks right. Okay. And so uh, let's assign these class to various columns. Okay. Uh, I want my uh, uh, username to be center aligned. So what I would do is let's set the class equals. Okay. Uh, let's say center, okay, and same for this user, I want this class equals center, and I want the email uh, to be right aligned, okay, class equals right, okay, class, oops, class 
equals right. Missing a quote here. Okay. And then I want my uh, description to be justified. Okay. Class equals justify. Class equals justify. Okay. Save it, minimize it, and see what we have in our browser. Refresh. So you see that our username has become center aligned as the header. Okay. Our email address is now right aligned, right? That touches the right border. And then uh, our description, even though it's still left aligned, it's uh, justified. I'll show you what I mean by that. Okay, look at this um, a very funny person line. Okay, and let me minimize it. Bring back top style. I'm just gonna add more lines to it. Also, a very generous person. Okay, save it, minimize it. Bring back Firefox. And then I'm going to watch this line. I'm going to refresh. So what this does is it evens the space out. Even though this space looks a lot bigger, it evens it out to fill this whole row before it wraps to the next line. Okay? So that's justified. Let me take out the justify class and let you see what, what it does without it. Okay? This is the column. Take it out, save it, minimize it, bring back Firefox, and refresh. You see that the line is a lot shorter, okay? But uh, it still wraps because um, this we only have this much cell space, but it doesn't stretch the line out to the end of, of the cell, okay? So that's justify, all right? And uh, the default is a uh, left. So um, I, I'm not going to show you that. Uh, you can uh, play with the uh, uh, different settings. Okay, so that's uh, text align using CSS. Okay, thank you.